You're watching New Car Spin. I'm your host, Brian, and this is how to keep your car sanitized during this crazy... Well, you all know what's going on. So, first things first, here in this awesome BMW X5, which was just delivered to me today by the press office, it was sanitized, yet I like to do these things myself just to ensure you know, extra measures like, I don't know, the seat belts were sanitized, just in case I missed that. So there are obvious ways you can get around this. You could first off, let me just get rid of the outside noise there. First off, you can obviously use antibacterial wipes. The cheap stuff from the store, the good stuff from the hospitals, or even what you might even steal from the grocery store when you're using the cart or the basket. Obviously, the second way is to use a disinfectant spray and just spray that all over the car on all the touch points. I do recommend this as well as the wipes together. However, there is another way and it's more primitive, but I definitely prefer it because it does, it does eliminate that very septic, sterile, antiseptic, uh, a hospital-esque scent that your car, such as this BMW, is going to have when you use all the Lysol and everything on it. And that is sage. So sage is actually proven to be effective at killing 94% of bacteria in the air. So while you can get rid of stuff on the surfaces, and sure you can roll down the windows and open the sunroof, well, what are you really doing to protect yourself and your passengers? How are you going to really make sure that everything in the car is protected? So obviously the only thing you can do is light up. And it is a smudge pot that you're supposed to use where you put out everything and you get this smoke, but this is the native ancient way, especially in North America, of dealing with problems like this. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe. I got plenty of videos for you to watch while you're holed up in your house. See you later.